What's going on guys? Welcome back to another video. So five supplements that I think all beginners should take and why. Quick note before that though, I know everybody when they join the gym for the first time or when they join the gym after a very long time, they get right into it. But before they actually start going to the gym, they start buying supplements and they start buying gym clothes and they spend a lot of money before they've even gotten to the gym. So if you're going to follow any of these guys and you're just joining the gym, I would highly recommend try and stay consistent for at least a month before you try and get into all of this. I know it's a lot, but at least you've proven your consistency to yourself before you spend all of that money. So supplement number one, very obvious, is whey protein. As a newbie in the gym or even someone coming back to the gym, the first recommendation that you'll get from people for what supplements to take is going to be whey protein. There's a lot of people that take whey protein and don't even know what it does. A lot of people that recommend it. And it's always just like, oh dude, it builds muscle. But very simply, whey protein is a fast digesting protein and it kind of gets to work quickly. So it gets all the amino acids that your body requires to repair and build muscles faster than other kinds of proteins. Next up, we have fish oil tablets. These are pretty common too. I'm sure when you were a kid or even now as an adult, your doctor must have told you like, you know, start taking these on a day-to-day -day basis in the morning. Now fish oil tablets aren't something that's gonna turn you into like a bodybuilder, but it's something that if you take every day, it actually prevents a lot of diseases and it actually just helps in your overall health. It's actually been known to help with a lot of uh, heart diseases and even fat loss. And this is one of those supplements that you can still take, like even if you're not training, like you can still continue to take it, like it's fine. Next up, brown chain amino acids. So like most supplements, you can actually find them in your food and they're essentially already a part of your diet. In the form of supplements though, they're highly concentrated and they actually get absorbed faster. Brown chain amino acids actually help in muscle growth and recovery. Pro tip though, uh, when you're actually training, throw some branching amino acids in your water bottle, the one that you drink uh, during your workout and just keep sipping on that. It'll actually help you maximize maintaining as much lean muscle as possible when you're going through a strenuous workout. Number four, it's a multivitamin. You should, you, should, you should know why you should be taking this. Next. Next up, onto my favorite one. And the one supplement that has the most research done out of all the supplements out there is creatine monohydrate. In a nutshell, creatine increases the water retention in your muscles, giving you a more fuller look. And it also gives you energy. So it kind of makes you look stronger and feel stronger. So take it. Honestly, this is one of my most favorite supplements. Forget everything that you hear about this whole loading phase and everything and just start with like one tablespoon spoon spoon one tablespoon and one spook anyways start with one tablespoon or one scoop of creatine monohydrate in the morning or whenever you actually want to have it just make sure you're having it every day at the same time even on your rest days and within a couple of weeks you should start feeling a bit more fuller when it comes to your muscles like when you're looking at the mirror you'll trust me you know what I'm talking about. Well, that's it for this one, guys. Thank you for watching. Hope you learned something. If you didn't, send it to someone who's just starting out. Maybe it'll help them. Uh, thanks for watching. Stay safe. See you on the next one.